make what I consider to be hands down the best garlic cheese toast you will ever try. I'm not even kidding. What makes this garlic cheese toast so unique is our secret ingredient, which is chipotle peppers. And all we're going to need is five simple ingredients. We've got Monterey Jack cheese, chipotle peppers, five cloves of fresh garlic, some butter, and some French bread. So join me while I show you how to make this delicious, quick, and easy, crowd-pleasing favorite. I went ahead and grated my Monterey Jack cheese, and I've sliced a loaf of French bread in half. I'm only going to use half of it tonight. And I've also cut it in half lengthwise, too, so that we're all ready to go. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get our chipotles ready. And we're going to want to seed these chipotles. We're only going to use a couple because these pack a lot of heat. So let's get a couple of these bad boys out of here. That looks like a good one. Alright, so what I'm going to do is cut the top off there where the stem goes, and I'm just going to slice this in half. And I'm going to remove all of the seeds. Okay, I've got my chipotles all seeded, and now I'm going to take this nice knife and I'm going to mince them. I want them really, really, really small, and I want to be able to blend them into the butter and not have some huge chunks in there. So let's. So we've got this into a nice paste. So what we're going to do now is we're going to mince five cloves of garlic into this butter. So let's do that. I'm going to run them through the garlic press. Okay. So we've got our butter kind of softened, so we're going to mix that garlic in there. Okay, now the chipotle paste is added, we're going to mix this all together and it's going to turn into a nice, beautiful red color. Now if you don't use this all the night that you make it, this will keep in the fridge for about a week I found, so if you have some extra, do save it because next time you get some french bread you can just whip this out of the fridge, put it on your bread and you'll have that delicious toast all over again. Okay, it looks like this is incorporated really well, so we're ready to get everything assembled. Okay, I've got my baking pan lined with parchment paper. That's just going to make cleanup a little easier. So we're going to go ahead and lay our two sides of French bread here. And we're going to kind of slather this mixture all over here. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and top these with our Monterey Jack cheese. You can use other kinds. Monterey Jack just works the best in my experience. Now I've gone ahead and preheated the oven to 350 degrees, so what we're going to do is we're going to bake these for about 15 minutes, and then as soon as the cheese looks totally melted and just bubbly and delicious, we're going to turn the broiler on for just a couple of minutes, and we'll watch it really carefully to make sure nothing burns, but they'll come out with just that nice toasty burn on top. It's going to be delicious. I think these are ready to go in the oven, so we'll put these in for 15 minutes. Oh, and you can see that cheese is all melted and bubbly, and you can see why I put the parchment paper down. We're going to turn the broiler on for about two or three minutes. We're going to watch it really closely and make sure it doesn't burn. Okay, this has been under the broiler for about three minutes, and it is starting to look just perfect. I think I'm going to go ahead and take that out. This is the best garlic cheese toast in the world. I hope you love it.